Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another Moment episode. It's time. We're at Baffin Bay. Jeff's getting his waders on. I'm about to, but first I'm gonna use that little, that little uh, outhouse right there. Mr. Eric himself. Baffin time. Mm -mm. I gotta get me some of them zip waders. Yeah, man. That's. that's it makes a di it makes a difference. Heck yeah. When you got a number one emergency. Yeah. You going right up there? Starting out with a little bit of Miss Piggy, the new three and a half inch bait. Yeah, he got off. No, like 12. Well then it's a big trout if it's a trout. He's taking drag. It is? It's a trout? Oh. Big, big old red. Jeff's on. What color are you throwing, Jeff? Bone, baby, thin bone. Oh, dude, that's a good one. Is it red? Oh. If he's a keeper, keep him. Here, I'll net him. He'll be out under. Too small. I got a big red on, I think. If it's a trout, it's a big one. If it's a trout, it's a good one. I think it's a red. Red. Red, good one. Yeah, he'll keep. Yeah. Yep. I didn't bring my stringer. Nice. Yep. Miss Piggy. Yeah, not huge, but good one. <laughs> hey, baby. Son of a gun. Here, go. Good one. Solid fish. Fin bone. Yellow mouth. Good job. Jeff over here smoking them on the new bait. I'm switching to a. Rudder bug, dirty dong color. Yep. 
Yeah. Me and Jeff doubled up. Choked it. Yeah, that's a good trail. He ain't come up yet though. Uh, it's gotta be a red. I'm filming. Watch out. Oh, big red. You got your... Yep. It's got that dirty dom rudder bug. Redfish. Everybody good? Yes, sir. Well, we caught a bunch of trout. Dad caught a winning tournament redfish. <laughs> and uh, he's like <laughs> just under 28 inches, and he was right, at, right under 8 pounds. So we're headed to Baffin now. Time to chase big girls. Oh my goodness, yeah. Nice flat fish. God. Oh, look at that sucker. It wasn't acting like a, something I had caught. Man, look at that. Dude. That is huge. It's a big one. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> That's good eating right there, buddy. Yeah. Heck of a lot better than that redfish. Yeah. Abby said she ain't never had flounder before. She is now, though. She gonna have some flounder now. Look at that. Hit your button. You got him? Yeah, I got him. I don't know what it is. Dude. Ah, oh, I went to my freaking leg. That's a stud trout. I can't believe you took you so long to net him. <laughs> yeah, Dad just caught his PB trout on Miss Piggy. Three and a half inch? Let's see here, what do we got? Oh, yeah. That's oh! Good fish. Yep, that's a good fish. That is my PB. 
Okay, hold him out towards me just a little bit. A good one, yeah. 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 Yeah, let me get that. That's yeah, a good picture right there. Good fish. Yeah, get that bait yeah, in his mouth. Bait in there. That's a perfect. Yeah, that's perfect right there. Perfect. Got it. Nice job, bub. That's perfect. Awesome. Oh. Yep. Quick release. <laughs> Eric, Eric's on a good one. Corky? No. Little three inch. Gotcha. Sweet. On a junior. Acting very really good, but it's acting like a red. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's nope, nope, big that's trout. That's a good trout. That's a good fish. Five pounder. Yep, good fish. Dirty Dom. Oh yeah, that's a great color. Yeah, I mean he's he's 22, so not bad. But he's right, right by that rock, right there. Then you can kind of see the, uh, kind of see it right there in the. Yeah, it is. Oh yeah, he's fighting. Here. Twenty-three. I don't know. He's pulling better. No, no, it's a big one. Oh, that's a, that's it's a, a big one. That's a good fish. Oh, yeah. Y'all get over here. Y'all get over here. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on to that. Oh, yes. That's a good one. That's what we're looking for. No, that's... No, this one's bigger than 27. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. That a boy, buddy. That a boy. That'll work. Choked it. Uh, the, he's still 26, 27, man. Yep. That's a good fish. Give me oh, a good. Get a good one of that. That's a, that's a great picture. Great fish. <sighs> Y'all just come on around backside right here. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Yep, that's the one, Mike. That's a good one. We'll get one a little bigger than him, but that's good. Absolutely, dude. Yeah, it is in the way. I got you. Peace. Yeah, All right. Me and Smollett Man getting it done. Yep. Got a boy. Get in here. What you got? Another big old trout. Ben bone eating them up, huh? Cast out there. Alright, Dad. Right? You can kind of see the rock when the sun hits it. Right at that on that line, but further. 
every cast I've gotten whacked. That's gonna be a fish. Come on, 30. Whacking them, little guy. I'll catch that all day, though. Mm -mm. Right red. Well, Jeff, what do you think about your kind of first time to bat? He went when he was like 14, but. Well, I caught two fish I never caught in my life before, so. Two fish? The flounder and the uh, personal best. Uh, oh, personal best. Trout. Yeah, personal best trout. My dad caught his personal best trout. I caught one that was like 24 and a couple 22s. But we kept our keeper reds and that big flounder that Jeff caught. So we're gonna take them back to the casa and clean them up. So I'll see y'all there. Thank you, Eric. Y'all go check sir. him out if y'all wanna do a trip to Baffin or Mansfield? Uh, Rockport. Rockport. Yeah. Rockport and Baffin. Y'all check him out. I'll leave his link in the description. All right, guys, we got fish to clean. We got places to be. So we're gonna do stuffed flounder for dinner. I'm gonna show y'all how I clean a flounder to stuff. A stuffed flounder, do you stuff it? You do. <laughs> we're gonna scale it. Just take the back of your knife or top of your knife. Get all those scales off on both sides. Guys, got it scaled. Now we're gonna take our knife. We're gonna cut right down that backbone just like that. Cut up. Cut down. Got it. And then we're gonna, well, we gotta chop the head off. Just like that, get the guts out. Now we're gonna take our knife and fillet it, but you're gonna stop short from filleting it off all the way. Basically gonna fold that meat over. So you wanna run your knife down all the ribs. Just like that, and then same thing on this side. And once you eat the top side, this whole skeleton will just pop right out. And you eat the bottom side. Now we have our flounder, we'll go inside, lay our crab meat in, fold it over, score it, or actually we don't have to score it, put it in the oven and bake it. So I'll see you guys in the kitchen. We're gonna stuff this flounder. So 
Open them up. Get some lump crab meat. Better if you catch it yourself, but our crab traps aren't producing right now, so. That lump crab meat in there. Just like that. Fold it back over. Take some critter glitter fish and fowl. Give it a little sprinkle. That skin's the best part right there. You can crisp it up. Just like that. Now we'll take a lemon. Play it like that, and then we'll also take some butter, put us some um, blocks of butter in here, anywhere you can fit it. We got the oven set to 400. We're gonna let her cook, and I'll show you what she looks like when she's done. Stuffed flounder for dinner. Coming up, we got some dirty rice over here. We got some ceviche if you watched the last video. If you haven't, you can go check out how we did that. Amazing. Stuffed flounder. Stuffed with. Stuffed with lump blue crab. So, I'm gonna let it cool down for a second, then we're gonna do a taste test. We got some rice. Now we need a spatula, or actually some tongs. We'll grab us a chunk of meat, just like that, and some lump crab. One out of ten. Let's see what it tastes like. You gotta get that blue crab in there with it. Mm. It's probably the best way to cook flounder right there. That's like a nine, nine four. Get that lemon seed out of there. Delicious. All right, ratings. One out of ten. What y'all think? Ten. Nine. I mean, it's flounders. Ten for me. I'm gonna give it a nine and a half. Sweet. We could have put a little more time into it, but we're really rushed, guys. You'll have to stay tuned for the next video. The sun's going down, and that means we're doing something at night on the bay. Leave it in the comments if you know what we're going to do. But y'all stay tuned for that video. Dad? I'll go eight and a half. There we go. That's better. That's good. Well, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Huge shout out to Eric. If y'all want to go to Baffin Bay or fish in the Rockport area, y'all check him out. His number will be in the description box. Um, and if you want some Mullet Man Bait Co. baits, y'all can go to MulletMan.net. So until next time, hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, and remember, eat good. Eat.